The city is a pilot for a new national program to help educate people about a genetic disease killing Americans. The black community is especially at risk. KMBC 9's Brian Johnson is live tonight to explain how to keep you and your family safe. Brian. Yeah, Bria, for Europeans, the amyloidosis affects about one in 100,000 people. So say one person in independence. But for African-Americans, it can be one in 25. We tonight are at a bus stop. Say there's a full bus here at the 63rd Street stop. That means one out of the 25 people on the bus would have this and might not even realize it. This is a serious issue in all too, where Kansas City Chief Art Still, number 67, is raising awareness about amyloidosis. I've been having heart problems and all kinds of health problems. and just recently got diagnosed back in October. He dealt with issues for years. Common symptoms include carpal tunnel, tingling, joint pain, back pain, heart failure, lightheaded or dizziness, fatigue, weight loss, or swelling of the feet. They say it's within, you know, the Irish community and also the African American, that's where it's real, a big impact. Five years ago, there was no treatment for amyloidosis. It was literally a death sentence. Mike Lane also has amyloidosis. New treatments can now extend your life and improve the quality of life, often as if you didn't have the issue. If patients have any signs and symptoms, they should get tested irrespective of age. A simple saliva test can save your life and that of your loved one. It could add a million life years to the current population in this country. This meeting is hosted by the Vineyard Neighborhood Association with leaders from across the country. They want to talk about health so more lives are improved and safe. We want to make people, educate them to be their own best advocates at the doctor's office. In Kansas City, Brian Johnson, KMBC 9 News. And advocates say some doctors are not familiar with the disease. Several local health systems have specialty centers just for this illness.